If you want to support the Predator Poachers catching the sickest both near and far, go to the pinned comment. If you're on Rumble, press the red join button to see over 30 videos early and uncensored for only $8 a month. We can't do this without your help, so join our locals. This channel is a group of investigative journalists who make educational documentaries showcasing and educating society, especially parents and legal guardians, about potential scenarios that result from young people and adults conversating online if left unchecked. We conduct thorough interviews with consenting adults in an attempt to understand their perspective on why they partake in these conversations online with people that are not of age. The goal of the interviews in these videos and the videos themselves is to gain an understanding of the perspective of the individual being interviewed so parents and the rest of society can be educated and aware of potential thought processes and desires of adults online to unsupervised persons not of age. These videos are not to cyberbully, harass, degrade, accuse, or threaten any individuals partaking in the interview process or in the video itself. We do not condone any of these actions. These videos are strictly educational, and we grant full permission for academia, which is any classroom setting or in scholarly papers to show or cite our videos. To ensure that these videos are strictly used for educational purposes, we strictly adhere to YouTube's community guidelines, such as not revealing someone's personally identifable information. In other words, PII. YouTube defines personally identifiable information as their home address, email addresses, signing credentials, phone numbers, passport number, medical records, or bank account information. We thoroughly look at and edit our videos to ensure that none of this information about any individual is shown in our videos. To ensure extra privacy for each person that is a subject of an interview in any of our videos, as of September 1st, 2022, to thoroughly comply with YouTube's harassment and bullying policy, there will be no mention or information about the last name or first name of any person interviewed in our videos. Due to potentially illegal activities discussed in our videos, law enforcement in the respective jurisdiction we conduct these interviews in is notified of each interview and video filmed by us. We are not accusing any individual interviewed of being guilty or committing a crime. That is the job of law enforcement. We are not vigilantes and we do not condone vigilantism or vigilante behavior, such as taking the law into your own hand or not notifying law enforcement when a suspected crime takes place. We are investigative journalists. Trigger warning. Some of what can be discussed in these videos can be sensitive to some, emotional or stressful. The only goal of these videos is to educate the public. At the end of each video, as of September 1st, 2022, there will be an educational portion at the end to discuss what was talked about in the video and to discuss what people can take from that video and learn from and tell others about. Our goal here is to bring awareness and educate the public. Now the video will start. Just go live on locals, just fucking do it. You say what? If we if we make contact, just go live on locals. Okay. Uh oh, they got a guard dog. How's it going? Okay. Is there a uh, dentist in here? Yeah. Okay. What do you got? How's it going? Got a package for you, sir. They put your uh, phone number on it. I have the right one. Is it? All right. Yeah. Okay. Might be boarding up by the way. Nice to meet you, bro. It's about some stuff on Signal that we should probably go over. We can talk about it in, in private. You just want to kind of go over there? Okay. All right, cool. Love your dogs. Yeah. I guess that's your son over there? Uh, grandson. Okay, yeah, I mean, we can, uh, if anybody asks what's going on, I'll just change the subject, it's all good. Um, my name is Gordon, by the way. Sorry to be you like this, but it's kind of some important stuff yeah, we should probably go fun. over. Um, it's about some uh, kind of groups on Signal and Telegram, that kind of, we've been in here on that. And just trying to kind of figure out what's going on here. Yeah. Because, you know, obviously I know you're a good guy and you're a family man and stuff. And I think, you know, we could probably come together and kind of figure out what's going on with all this stuff. Um, hi, baby. What's the dog's name? Uh, Jasper. Oh, hi, Jasper. Boy or girl? Uh, he's a boy. Okay. And uh, uh, Izzy's over here. She's a girl. All right. Cool, man. Um, so, yeah, I, I kind of want to ask about these groups. Like, all, all, like when, when did you first get the Signal app? Uh... I've had signal for uh, uh, video calls. Okay, got it, got it. And what about a Telegram? I uh, don't belong to Telegram. Okay, that's kind of been gone. Telegram's been gone. Been gone. Yeah. I don't know what it is. Okay, so just signal. Uh, signal and uh, Zoom and uh, seems like there's another one. Uh. I don't know. For Zoom calls, I don't know. Okay, got it. Uh, do you know about when uh, you might have gotten Signal? Because 
I wouldn't have a clue. Okay. I'm sure it was uh, to talk to somebody, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah, no problem. So there's some groups here um, that either somebody's put you in or whatever, some way, somehow, we just found the group. Um, this group called... I don't know anything about that. Okay. Um, cause you know, yeah, you've had signal for a while and you know, I've had those types of apps. I don't know about signal specifically, but you know, I know on those apps, you can get like a lot of people just adding you to bullshit and stuff like that. Yeah. And I don't know, I'm thinking that could have happened because there's a, a few groups that, um, you know, that they put your pro your doodle, right? Okay. Uh, no, I don't know. Okay. Well, I don't doodle on anything. <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, that's. Is that just the name you kind of use on Signal? Just oh, doodle? it probably is. I just make up names when I'm not going to use the app. Okay. Know? Yeah, no problem. Um, but they've added this, you know, doodle profile with your number on it to, to, to quite a few groups um, on, on Signal. And, you know, I'm kind of here to c figure out. I, I didn't know they had groups. I've got groups on Facebook. Groups on Facebook? Yeah. Well, no, Signal's not really, it's not really a lot groups. Of fishing. Yeah, so it's not really groups, it's more like just group group messages, kind oh. of, like a lot of people. That kind of ring more of a bell? No. Okay. Well, some of these groups I that... I don't think I've even got Zoom on my... I'm sure it's still on the phone, but I I mean, I didn't delete it, but I don't. I haven't used it in forever. No, I'm talking about Signal with this. Oh, Signal? Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. same thing. Just, okay. Well, there's... The yeah, no problem. Um, well, there's, there's group chats that uh, people have added uh, your phone number to. And I'm kind of here to figure some stuff out about that. Like, I don't think, you know, obviously I don't think you're a bad person. I'm trying to figure out, did you like create any of these groups yourself? No, I've never created a group on Facebook or anywhere else. Okay, got it. Well, I mean, I know everybody's on groups on Facebook. I mean, shit in my own neighborhood I am. I mean, if you, if you have any bit of social skills, you'll be in a group on Facebook. Yeah, yeah. But. Most of them's old Hickory Lake. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Um, but you know, I'm talking about kind of these group chats on Signal that people are adding you to. Um, there's one called a here and I kind of just want to know kind of when they started adding you to this. Cause you know, oh, I don't have a clue. Well, like I said, I yeah. haven't been there for forever. Okay. Well, you know, uh, Dennis, I didn't come here to kind of ask you about if you're in the groups. I just came here to ask when you were added and stuff like that, because, you know, I didn't come to your house thinking you're a bad guy. I didn't come to your house thinking that you're the head of any of this stuff. I think more we can kind of just figure out what's in the groups, kind of figure out who's doing it and go after the real bad guys with this type of stuff. Cause I mean, you told me you're a grandfather. Yeah. That's pretty important, I think, to fight this stuff together. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. So, um, what you know, are we fighting? well, we're fighting kind of, there's people in these groups. Um, I'm sure as you know, cause they've added you to a few of them and they're posting like pictures of just younger people. Oh, no, I haven't, haven't added any pictures or anything. To, uh, mm -hmm. I haven't put any on Facebook in a long time. I haven't been fishing in a while. No, sure. No, I'm talking about the uh, signal groups, though. Yeah. Like the signal well, group chat. I haven't added anything to anything. Okay. Okay. So you haven't posted anything in those groups? Uh uh. Okay. That's kind of what I think it is, though. I think they just kind of been adding you to shit, and it's kind of that they're doing it while you're just kind of around. You know what I mean? Um, like, uh, what was we had, uh, Fish Network. Yeah. And hell, I got added to a bunch of shit in there and come to find out I spent it three or $400 a month. That With I didn't addition. Know. Okay. Okay. Um, when's the last time you were on Signal? Oh, it's been ages. Ages. Okay. Well, you know, Dennis, we can just kind of, I'm just going to let you know, man. And, you know, like I said, dude, I mean, do, do you still work? Yeah. Okay. Oh, what, what do you do for work? I work second shift at. Uh... What does that do? Uh, I work uh, in uh, industrial maintenance. Okay. Uh, we make uh, the blue plastic boxes for plug-ins and mm -hmm. light fixtures. And oh, so literally you keep the world going. Well, pretty much. Yeah, I mean, I appreciate that shit, man. Yeah. We definitely need more people in industry rather than just, you know. Uh, what do you need me to do or? Well, I, I kind of want to figure out why this happened because, you know, you are too good of a person to kind of be around these people and, you know, everybody kind of, falls into bullshit online. I mean, it's the internet, okay? And, you know, I'm kind of trying to, to figure out, like, is this something that's like a pattern? Is this something that's just been started to happen? I don't know. 
because you know all I know is that they're adding you to these groups or yeah. some way somehow you're finding them. But I think what you can kind of help me with is where are these groups coming from? Like how are these groups being advertised to where? Because I don't think you're online just looking up dark world. I don't think that's happening. But I think if we can kind of get like a source of where it's coming from, I think that's something we can come together on and kind of separate you from all those those people. So you kind of know where those groups would be advertised for people to just find or click on? I uh, wouldn't have a clue. Okay. Well, how did, how did you get in these groups? I uh, don't have a clue there either. Okay. Well, how, how do you think people have been adding you to this stuff? Because, again, I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you doing this. Well, I, mean, I, mean, I don't know. Uh, I know I've had my Facebook hacked before, but now, okay. like I said, I haven't done this. I haven't been on Zoom in forever. So well, this is a signal. Well, signal, I haven't been on that. To me, it's the same thing because that's what it was used for was video call. To video call? Okay. Who introduced Signal to you? I was trying to think who contacted me on Signal. Mm -hmm. oh, shit, I can't remember now, but it. One of my friends, I'm sure, from years ago, but uh, like I said, I haven't used it in ages and ages. Okay. You just what, talk to friends online and shit? Uh, yeah, at that time, yeah. Okay. I think it might have been when one of my buddies died and we might have been trying to get together with some of the family. And stuff. Oh, really? Who Who is it that, like... Uh, oh, shit. lived in Kentucky. He died about a year ago. Man. Oh, really? Was he like your best friend or something? Or? Uh, yeah, he used to be... We well, used to be pretty tight. Damn. How'd he die, if I may ask? Uh, they found him dead. Natural causes. He was 63, I think, or 64. Yeah. They got to missing him a couple of days and found him in his room. Jesus Christ. Did you go to his funeral? Uh, no, I did not. Okay. They didn't have a funeral there. Damn, he didn't have like no family no, or anything? They, uh, or? Just had him cremated. And yeah. Damn, man. I'm sorry to hear that. You okay from that? Oh, yeah. Okay. That's good. Uh, do you like we're still work full time and all that? Yes. Nice, man. Shift. That's where I'm headed now. Okay. Well, um, you know, Dennis, like these kind of groups here um i really am very sure that you're not the head of any of this stuff and that you didn't create this but you know i kind of want to figure out like again how this is happening because i didn't come here on a question i came here that I, there's some things that we do know there's you know, like obviously that they put you in the groups or some way somehow you joined them maybe you didn't know what they were i don't know i don't know i mean if people like just linked you said join my group before and you click on it it's just been some other shit you didn't expect I'm trying to think of a reason that this would be happening, man. Uh, no, I haven't. Like I said, I haven't been to Signal in forever, so I haven't clicked on join anything. Okay. Well, I mean, on, on Signal groups, uh, they can add you to it. Like, they can, you know, put your name in there. But you actually have to physically press join on these. And you may not see what's there before you press join, but, you know, if they just added you randomly and you didn't join, you wouldn't be listed on here. Right. So you, pre you press join, but... I'm just trying to know if this is what you expected it to be or whatever, because, you know, obviously you're a grandfather. And I'm sure you don't condone the stuff they're posting in no, here. I do not. So, I, like I said, I don't, I didn't know I was in any groups on Signal or. Okay. Well, Dennis, I'm going to have to just lightly counter you on that because, you know, we can kind of see that there's some stuff clicked on in those groups, okay? Like it wasn't just. Like you, to your credit, you haven't posted anything we have, we've seen. Um, right. And I don't think you'd ever take it that far. But, you know, there has been stuff clicked on. And there's truly a difference between, you know, watching a car wreck versus crashing cars, right? And uh, if some of this stuff was just sometimes a morbid curiosity or whatever, I don't know. But I'm trying to kind of give you the benefit of the doubt here with this stuff. Because, you know, it's, it's, it's more than one group. And it looks like it's a lot of foreigners in there just kind of around i mean is it i mean dennis like you told me that you got signal to start with video calling people which yeah. which yeah that's totally fine i mean but like i said dude i've been in that position where i've gotten that for one thing and then it turns into a kind of a shit show um with other stuff and is that could that have been something that happened with you here because you know we're not going to deny it happened because it, it just did um and we saw stuff that was clicked on to your credit you weren't on there 24 7 just clicking 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 that's not you but morbid curiosity, I have no idea. Like, I'm trying to figure out what it is. Like, was this a curiosity that you wanted to initiate yourself or did someone bring you into this? I'm trying to, that's what I'm trying to figure out here, dude. 
I haven't. I didn't know I was clicking on anything. Okay. Well, Dennis, man, I'm just gonna ask you, dude, like, just man to man, okay? You work too hard, okay? You have a lot. Like, don't, don't let some internet bullshit just kind of bite, come bite you in the ass when it doesn't have to, because I'm more concerned about who's actually producing this type of stuff in these groups. I'm not really concerned about you. The only reason I'm here at your house is because I'm 99.9% .9 sure that you have nothing to do with any of these photos or videos that it's just people in the groups that actually do, doing this stuff. And I think you can kind of help me with that stuff. That's what I'm here for, man. And I was thinking, especially since you, I don't know you had grandkids, but especially since you have kids of your own, I thought this was something that we could kind of uh, come together on, man, okay? You're not the creator of the Signal app. You're, you're not the one who made any of these groups, I don't think, no. okay? Unless you just learned Spanish in the sticks of Tennessee, which I found out that happened. No. But it, it's more of something that I just care about what they're kind of, who's doing it who's actually doing the participation in there and i mean i don't think you're doing any of that but you know obviously people get the wrong idea just seeing you kind of listed in there and that's kind of what i want to separate i don't want to i want to separate you and actually find the real bad guys the producers of this stuff and you know that's not something that i don't want help on man like i didn't come here with all the answers i came here with just basic knowledge that some stuff was clicked on in the group and that they either added you or you were listed in a bunch of them okay okay so <clears throat> You know, one thing too, I mean, about Telegram, you know, I didn't hear the truth about Telegram. You were last on there February 6th, all right? That's- On Telegram? Yep. Okay. Not that I know of, but- it, Right? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, you were last- Is that on something that uh, you could be transferred to? Like you go here and you go to a link and it goes there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, could that have been what happened? It could have been. I don't know. If okay. I was there, that's what happened. Okay. Okay. Because I didn't come here kind of thinking like, you know, you just go on signal and that's what you're looking for. That's not kind of, I mean, if that is, I mean, is that the case? What? Like you just came on signal just kind of looking for this stuff? No. Okay. I okay. I haven't looked for anything. Okay. Okay. Because there are, there are two ways that this stuff kind of happens. One of them is, one of them is like... You just get signal, you know damn well what you want to look for, and it can be kind of rough, right? And then the other way is you mentioned something about you click a link and then it transfers you to something. Yeah, uh, I mean, I've done that on uh, on other sites, yeah. Okay, okay. So that's that's kind of what I think more because a lot of the foreigners in these groups, like... So Telegram, I don't know anything about it. Okay. So this person right here uh, in this... group this we believe he's one of the admins of this group so that's somebody for example who kind of makes the group himself for that explicit reason and Do kind they of profit from this group or uh depends if they're selling stuff that's what oh, i don't, I don't know. know yeah I I they, they might i mean It'd be a pretty uh, pretty ballsy thing to do that with for, for charity. I've never paid to use Signal, so. Okay, so you haven't even bought any of this stuff? No, okay. I don't. Okay. I haven't paid anything to Signal. I thought it was all free. Yeah, yeah, whatever. yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, we don't see any, I mean, as far as I know, we don't see any records of you trying to buy any of this stuff either. So, I mean, if there's a totem pole to this shit, you're at the very, very bottom if you've been on it at all. I don't even think you are. But, so I was saying people, are the ones that get signal for this explicit reason. I mean, you said you got into video call somebody, but they get signal for this explicit reason, make these groups and get people added to it. That See, that, those type of people are the people I'm actually going after. You, I mean, you mentioned that a link can transfer you to this shit. That's kind of what I was thinking it could have been, okay? That's more of like a benefit of the doubt thing where it's like, you know, you're browsing on a site. I mean, if you're on, if you're on Instagram, you're not on signal, you're not looking for signal. Right. So, I guess that's a. I guess that's a better. I guess that's a better uh, question. Is there shit that's been posted on other sites, like links that have led you to Signal, in some of these groups? Because th th I think that's probably the best explanation here. Or that's probably one of the one that makes the most sense. Uh, that's yeah. I mean, I haven't been on Signal that I know. Mm -hmm. But like I said, it, unless I was transferred there somewhere. Okay. Where do you think you could have been transferred from? Because I think those those platforms, just allowing those links to be posted are kind of crazy too. Uh, it would have to be Facebook. Or, really? Uh, 
I would say TikTok, but I hadn't been on TikTok in a couple of years, I know. Okay. Well, Signal's more recent than a couple of years, so it had to be a Facebook. Okay. So you think you think it's a, it could be a high possibility that somebody was just in some Facebook comments, posted a link to some random link and it led to like a Signal group? Could have been. Okay. Do you happen to know when that could have been or what Facebook page it could have been on? Because that's, you know, obviously the source of that's pretty important. And obviously you didn't create this Facebook page yourself, but it's more of being able to find that would be important. Lord, I'm in 5,000 groups on Facebook. I don't... God damn, man. Collins fishing and yeah. lakes and state parks. and Really? Okay. You're a nature guy. Yes. How many acres do you have? Uh, acre and a quarter. God. When did you get this house? Uh, 2015. Right before it all. Hi. How's it going? It's going. Good. Right before it all just skyrocketed. Yeah, and then right after we bought it, we had a kitchen fire. So nice. we had to move out and get all that fixed. And yeah. Well, that's freaking high. How much did you get it for, if I may ask? Uh, 213. Yeah, it's, dude, it's probably worth three times the price now. Uh, I wouldn't doubt it. God, man, freaking lucked oh, out. Uh, the house right the other side of that little gray pump house. Yeah. I think it sold for seven, seven eighty something. This Unbelievable, time. dude. You ever think of selling this place? No. Well, yeah, it's pretty peaceful I here. I love it. Yeah, right, right next to Nashville, so you can do all the city shit, but it's like, don't even feel it, man. Yeah, we're like 10 minutes from Hendersonville or White House or Gallatin or wherever you want it to go. Yeah, it's nice. Is that your wife right there? Yeah. Nice, man. Um, do you, you know, I've, I've, I'm not married yet, but I have a girlfriend. I mean, just guy to guy. Do you like watching? Uh, I have in the past, but not in a long time. Okay. My stuff ain't worked in a long time. <laughs> Even, do you just kind of, uh, do you have an Instagram? No. Okay. It's just, so just Facebook. Do you just kind of, uh, I mean, I do this on Instagram cause I'm, I'm kind of younger, but you know, you're older. So Facebook makes more sense. Do you like kind of, uh. Do you just kind of like browse on Facebook and maybe just like cute woman pop up and just kind of just like look at them dance? I have, yeah. Okay, okay. Because I don't think they're posting signal groups on fishing pages in, you know, Hickory, Kentucky. Oh, I wouldn't think so. Yeah, yeah. But face just your main page. Yeah, okay. It comes up then. So where do, where do you think these links could have been posted, these signal groups? Because you said Facebook, but you, you mentioned there's been some... Uh, there's been some just kind of, you know, shaking, whatever. You're going to be late. Yeah, I'm working on it. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's kind, of, it's kind of an important convo, but he's, he'll get through it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, I really wouldn't know. Okay. Because, I mean, that's really all that I go to is Facebook and... Uh, Pretty much it. Okay, got it. Some games. I mean, I go to games on Facebook. Uh, well, not on Facebook, but uh, Google Play Store. Okay, but you think the highest probability of this happening is someone posted this link, these links on some Facebook page, and it just leads you to this? Probably. Okay, okay. That makes that actually makes a lot of sense because um, we can kind of see. Uh, kind of the difference in uh i guess you could say levels of this i mean if your name's doodle on there i don't really think anything of doodle but if your name is uh knows that's probably something to that might raise an eyebrow i'd say if you if you would agree on that i don't think yeah um but you know isn't on facebook just looking at like chicks in bikinis just kind of walking he's 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 on signal for one reason um okay so now that I know that this was not something that you actually went looking for, it was more something that you probably stumbled across, um, I'm, I think it's best that we, you know, kind of figure this out because I, I really think you're doing a great job of separating yourself from these real assholes doing this type of shit. Um, do you know about when it, when those transfers started, started from, like, say, Facebook to Signal? Like, how long after you actually got Signal, if, you, if you're with your best guess? Uh, probably pretty quick. Really? Yeah. I mean, when you when you get on a site, then it usually sends you stuff. But, but I don't think I've ever got any texts or emails from 
me see. Excuse me one minute. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> yeah, I know. Thank you, everybody's coming to see you. Nobody's coming to see you. Like, well, it's probably a transfer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, like back over. Yeah, of course. Who do you uh, deliver for, ma'am? Just a local company? You're English. Oh. Sorry. Got it, got it. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Timu. I've got to I can't live without Timu. You like that? You like that Chinese shit? You can't, you can't escape it. Well, most of what I got is about the same thing as the you know, Bass Pro or Cabela's or... Is, so is Timu actually like useful and shit? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Is it like that much cheaper? I haven't been on there. Yes. Uh, so, a lot of things are. Some things aren't, but most of it is. So what's that, for example, that you got? Uh, I don't know. I have to open it up and see. All right. Well, unboxing here. Oh, that is a uh, yoga pad that I'm going to slice up and make planer boards out of. Two of them in there. All right. How much longer y'all figure y'all gonna be talking? Uh, it could be a little bit. All right, y'all mind moving so I can get out and go to work? Yeah, is that cool? Yeah. Yeah. Now just said, Where are you going in? Now she's just gonna take her car. Oh, okay. A zippy diver, some fishing pole rings, fishing line. All right. All for five bucks. Uh, probably, I think these were two thirty something The line was a dollar and something. Yeah, most of it's two or three dollars. Golly, man. Booger. Uh, I'm good. I'm a water guy. Actually, yeah. Appreciate it. God. <laughs> this is getting good. Huh? This is good. Yeah, I like it. All right. It's still is. Damn, it's not bad. No, I like it. So uh, what what do you need me to help you with? Well, I'll just, is it, I'll just wait till you're, is that, is you, that's your grandson? Uh, this is, yeah. How old is he? He's uh, 19. Oh, okay, okay. God, he looks like he's uh, 25, 26. I know. He ever played sports or anything? Uh, no, he played baseball a little bit, a little league. That's about it. Got it. So yeah, he's like 6'4". Yeah. Down no kidding, dude. Does he work where you do? Yeah. Nice. So, where you work, do you actually get like, uh, do you do you get like pay scale? They scale you up and shit. Like, you, are you like getting the seniority and all that? Uh, they don't really go by seniority, but yeah, they. Nice, nice. All right. You get like benefits and all that. Yeah. Oh, f yeah, dude. All right. Yeah, so. I'm going to find it here. So you've been working, how long have you been working there for? Uh, 10 years. Nice, man. What did you do before, if I may ask? Uh, I worked at a diecast plant in Kentucky. Okay. What brought you down to Tennessee? Uh, my wife, mostly. You, you, she lived down here, so. I moved down here with her. Oh, you got married like recently again? Uh, 
2018 we got married. Nice, man. Um, so this is so this is your second wife or third, third? Third. All right, nice. You think she's the one forever? I hope so. Yeah, man, definitely. You're gonna be, you're gonna be just like Trump. You gotta get, get have four wives. I mean, <laughs> oh, I hope not. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I like him. I like him, but you know, he's 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 ran through women a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Um, whatever. I, I just want my tax to lower the border close, honestly. Um, but all right. Speaking of border close, these freaking man. Um, okay. So I'm thinking what happened is, and again, that that's something I didn't know before coming here. That's something that actually gave me a peace of mind about all this. Uh, so you're browsing Facebook, just being an old guy who isn't. Some link pops up, you click on the link, it just leads you to a world of bullshit, pretty much. Is that kind of? Uh, that happens a lot. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. So, um, so, so I, I mean, obviously what I'm about to ask you to be a tough question, but obviously it's one that, it's like the million dollar question here kind of needs to be answered here, I, I'd say, because, you know, one, this is a way to flip it around on these people actually doing it, because, you know, if I could just talk to you, then get in, info on, 30 guys are actually into this stuff. I mean, what a win that is, right? Um, okay, so when do these Facebook links just getting posted on there start turning into this type of shit? I don't, I couldn't tell you. Okay. I mean, is it something that was recent? Is it something that was like been going on for a couple years or? Uh, no, I haven't been on. Uh, like I said, I only got on signal like a year ago i think that's when i got on it I was uh, talking to some of my friends family okay but you know you mentioned to me that you've been transferred from groups from face or you've been transferred as signal from like facebook links that people just randomly posted um yeah i would say if that's if that's what happened then that'd be the only way that i'd get there okay So what kind of links was it kind of leading you to? Like, were there groups other than this subject matter that they were leading you to? Like, were they leading you to like NASCAR groups on Signal? I don't think those really exist. I don't know what groups are on Signal. I didn't know there were groups on Signal. Okay. Well, I'm just talking about these group mes these links to these group messages. I'm yeah. not talking about like a group on Signal about, you know, Hickory, Tennessee or anything like that. Yeah. Um, but you know, if, if you see if you've seen kind of provocative photos on Facebook of adults, which is whatever, it's fine. Um, people post links on those all the time to shit that you're not even looking for, and you know we know those were clicked on. We could only the only thing we could see is those groups were joined and that there was some stuff seen in those groups. We don't know where the link was clicked from. It doesn't tell us that. But if you're saying Facebook, that's that's a pretty believable thing. That's something that would make a lot of sense. I don't think you were on the. You know, I don't think you're on the dark web just no. scoring for this and then you see a link for signal. It doesn't really, you don't really strike me as that type of guy to do that. But Dennis, I mean, it wasn't just one group. It was, it, it was a few. And, you know, I know you're just recently married and stuff like that. And I get it, man. Guys on the internet, like, dude, I have a girlfriend. You know how much I watch? Like way, way more than I like to admit to. That's a lot. Um, five times a week at least all right but i'm not even saying you're trying to watch i'm just saying that yeah when we see on facebook or instagram it can definitely lead us to some other shit too okay i'm not saying that you're the head of any of this shit i'm just saying at some point and i'm thinking it's from the facebook links you ended up in these groups okay if these groups didn't exist in the first place you wouldn't be on them um if you if these people were decent human beings they wouldn't be you know you wouldn't be on this shit right it's obviously people leading, put, sucking you into a black hole. You got sucked into some internet bullshit, and now it's time to kind of un unwind from that, okay? Don't be, you know, I've talked to a few people about this type of stuff, and it wasn't like, you know, or anything like that. It wasn't people I think that are actually participating in this stuff. It was the people that I kind of feel are in your situation where, you know, they were browsing on Facebook, trolling around, they get added, and, you know, it just becomes a shit show, it gets a little bit carried away from there. And, you know, a few of them, that's well actually most of them have told me like yeah this is kind of what happened and you know i actually saw that hey they're not actually participants in this type of stuff and with those people it's kind of easy to kind of like brush them to the side and go after those other bad people but there's also been a few where it's like 
you know, oh, I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know. And then it turns out they're just as, you know, they're just as severe as the, you know, and the rest of them. Don't be those guys. Cause that, that was the least I was expecting from you, man. I was expecting you to be more of a guy who's just like, yeah, this has kind of been, these assholes have been kind of adding me to some bullshit, trying to get me into some bullshit. Um, you know, obviously these pictures, I don't think are yours. I don't know, but I'm thinking that's what it is. Cause look, if it was one group, Dennis, then I'd be like, okay, this could be just a fluke, but it's, it's, it's more than one. It's like two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like it's a lot, man. I didn't even print out every group you're in. I just printed out a few and that's not an accident. That's obviously something you notice because I know you notice because we can track signal activity. We can see what's clicked on. Does that mean it's the end all be all? No, because if I, if I thought that I wouldn't be here talking to you, I, I think there has to be an actual explanation behind it. Maybe just curiosity or just boredom because that's a lot different than actually just you know having a basement full of people basement full of kids chained up and stuff i don't fucking obviously i know you don't have that but some of these people probably do and that's kind of what i'm trying to find out man that's kind of what i'm going yeah. after so uh, dennis i'm asking you to help me on this man because you're too good of a guy well, to I'd say what do i need to do to help you okay well like i said if i followed the link it had to be from facebook okay so it had to be from facebook okay um, so I, I, I'm just going to say, if you're sincere about helping me, just be transparent with me. I'm transparent with you, Dennis. Yeah. Okay. How, how we'll, we'll just call it a, um, cause that's what these groups are. It's they're big, just, you know, start off small, then it just swirls into just a whirlwind of bullshit. When did these types of on signal start like in your experience so when did you first start like i'm not saying you know you were ever curious about this stuff or ever like this stuff but at some point you started getting added to it that's objective fact and i'm not going to argue with you on that but i'm only asking your experience because if it's reaching you know the average hardworking guy in tennessee it's probably expanded a lot you know so in your experience when did people start posting links to these group these types of groups on facebook like when did when's a ballpark of when that started I'm not saying you need to remember January 17th of this year or anything yeah. like that. I'm just saying like a ballpark number. I'm not, you're not going to tell me the exact right answer, which is fine, but just a general time frame is fine. Uh, I don't know, maybe six months ago, something like that. Okay. It ain't, you know, I don't, that's not something I do every day. Or, right, right. So this isn't something that's been a lifelong. Oh, no. Okay, okay. It's just been kind of a new phenomenon here. That's fair. Okay, well, that's good. I mean, if you've only been in this stuff for six months, then we can easily just get you out of it. That's a that's an easy thing to do. Um, okay, so so basically, in, in short, sig signals turned into kind of other extracurricular bullshit the past six months. Is that kind of a fair thing to say? Uh, like I said, I don't go to signal, so. Okay, well. I, I guess my question is, when did you start seeing these Facebook links or these links on Facebook posts that led to groups like this? Uh, like I said, the only time I've done that is like in the last six months. Okay. So them posting, uh, so them posting links to kind of inappropriate stuff is a, a new thing for them that you've seen? Well, no, I'm sure it's been there before. Just I never have clicked on it or. Okay. But so only the past six because months. Because of this, I, you know, I figured, hey, you look at that stuff and you're going to get sure. something's going to happen. Sure. But, you know, out of all the things that could happen, kind of identifying the real bad guys is the best possible thing. Because you're a grandfather and shit, man. Okay. So you've been avoiding it for a while, but then the past six months have just kind of been, just, just kind of just kind of changed a little bit. Uh, yeah, I guess. All right, that's fair. Um, okay. So... Do you know about, oh man, do you know like what languages these groups are typically in? Cause I mean, I see one here in Spanish, but obviously I didn't look through however many groups we're in. Do you see like any recurring languages in these groups? No. No. I mean, I don't know anything but English, so. Okay. No, no, that's fine. I'm not saying you speak to them, but but do you see like is it do you see a lot of English or is it like other languages you see in these groups? Oh, there's other languages in all groups. Okay. Do you, God, what's a good question here? 
are they using i mean i see i know spanish use a b c d e f g blah 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 but in these other groups are they using like the english letters too or is it like complete other languages like symbols and all that stuff uh i've seen some samples yeah really or what um, some kind of foreign language but i don't know what it is it's not letter regular letter okay so it's some shit we could not possibly even read okay i see um what would you say the most prevalent language is like is it some shit you can't even read or is it like spanish or english or probably most of the groups i'd say was spanish okay i appreciate you telling me that because we obviously want to narrow it down i'm not saying you're gonna i'm not saying you're gonna be the reason you know we we find little in cancun but you, I mean, right there with what you just told me, you just eliminated Ukraine, Russia. You know what I mean? Like now, now you just took off like a billion people. This could be, you know what I mean? So I, I mean, I appreciate you for that, truly. I mean, you're, this is saving kids right here. Um, is there anybody in these groups that you noticed that would post more than others? Like any usernames that stick out to you, especially? Uh, never paid any attention to any names or... Okay, that's fair. Um, but you think... Uh, Spanish is the most spoken one or the most common language that pops up in these Probably. groups. That's fair. Okay. Um, are the thesis of these groups like, are they mostly posting boys, girls? Are they mostly posting like boys, girls, or both, or? What I looked at was uh, mostly women, yeah. Mostly women? Okay. I see. Well, I know you're a connoisseur of women, as am I. That's, that's, that's our thing, right? But, you know, I'm not... I'm not here because we're talking about women and men. I'm not... We're not talking about Victoria's Secret models or, you know, Calvin Klein or whatever those... Well, you know, whatever. Um, you know, I'm not here to talk about that, okay? So, you telling me you look at women, that's that gives me a peace of mind. That's great, good. Um, but I'm talking about what these people are posting. I'm not talking about what you looked at. I'm talking about what they've posted. Um, so, have you seen them post mainly like boys or girls, like in these groups? Or has it been kind of, kind of both? I don't know. Uh, it's been both, but... Really? Okay. H have you seen a... Have you seen like any of them specifically talk about what they've done to any of these people? To like, no, they haven't. Okay, as far as you know, they haven't like talked about this is me with him. Okay, that's fine. A lot of them wouldn't <laughs> just blatantly raise their hand and say that. That's fine. It totally makes sense. Okay. Um, what are kind of uh, what are kind of the age ranges that these assholes have posted it kind of in these groups? Teens and twenties, I guess. Okay. What what's teens? Uh, you know, eighteen and up. Okay. Well, Dennis, I, I know it's hard to talk about, but a group with someone named and they're not posting stuff that's eighteen and plus. Um, I'm operating under the not. It's not even an assumption. It's just the straight up truth that they're posting a lot of stuff that's probably makes me and you uncomfortable in there. Um, do they post women in there? Yeah, I'm sure they do. I'm not saying that 500 people are just posting, you know, it's like a pizza buffet, you know, you can choose what you like, but I'm not asking about them posting 18 and plus. That'd be a waste of both of our time to just lie about that. I'm just asking like, what's, what are kind of the age range that these other assholes have posted? I'm not saying that you even looked at or anything or even were curious about. I'm just saying, you know, if, if that house burns down and there, we think there's an arsonist, I'm going to ask you who, 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 who burned that house down. I'm not going to accuse you of burning the house down, right. but I'm going to ask like, hey, what's going on in that house? Um, so that's kind of what I'm asking with what these people are posting. Yeah. You, you can't control what somebody's posting. Right. You're not the admin. You don't have any powers to stop what they're posting. So I'm not blaming you for what they're posting. But, you know, being that we were in the group, I'm kind of just asking what they were posting. So like what age ranges have these assholes have just thrown out there? Tell you the age range. If I saw something young, I didn't look. I got off quick. Okay, okay. 
Okay, so have there been times where somebody's posted something young and it kind of made you uncomfortable and you'd- Oh, very uncomfortable. Okay, okay. Um, how often in these groups have these assholes just post, posted young? So is it like a common thing or? I wouldn't think so. Okay, but there's been a few bad apples who have just kind of like. Oh, I'm sure there are. There are everywhere. Yeah, yeah, but you know, I'm talking about like in the little angels. Like, group, have there been groups that you've been in where someone's posted something young and it made you uncomfortable and you clicked off of it? Yes. Okay. Oh, I hate to ask you to relive this because I know it's not comfortable for you as a granddad, but you know, again, this could easily be your grandkids and it could easily be my kids in the future, right? right. So, um. When they posted young shit, was it like pictures, videos, or both, or? Uh, I've seen both. What? Goddamn. But uh, that's not something that I... Indulge in. Right. Yeah, that's fair. That's total, that's kind of what I figured. Um, so when they, when they post like pics and videos, are these like a boys or girls, or kind of both, or? Uh, mainly girls was, what it, was the only thing I noticed. Okay. Um, what kind of goes on in the videos? I mean, I think... Oh, I, I don't know. Okay. Okay. That's, uh, what about, like, the pictures? Like, what's kind of showing? They're usually scantily clad or showing something. Just... Uh, I'm sure some of them are. Okay. Um, so they just... Are, are these like back full frontal or both or both both okay so this is kind of important because this actually helps lead us to the people doing this stuff so when there's a dude of um you know some underage girl in the group uh does it look like does it look like she's kind of taking the selfie herself like this or does it kind of look like it's, somebody's behind the camera taking a photo I tell you that um not that experience with whatever's going on. Well, sure, but you just kind of take one that kind of can ring a bell. Was the girl holding anything in her hand? Like, I mean, like, did it look like she was like kind of doing this? Like, like, could you could you see basically everything from the chest down to the down to her legs? Well, most of them were close, so could be selfies. Okay, so what could you see on the close-up ones? whatever they're taking a picture of. Okay. I hate to ask you this, but it's kind of important because somebody could even be directing them to take that picture. What were they yeah. taking pictures of? Uh, mainly just like from the waist up. Okay, so you could see their little and stuff? Yeah. Okay. Um, what was the common race of these girls? Well, I don't know. Okay, or were they brown, white? Or? Both. Both, okay. Um, what was kind of the, and again, you're not an expert on age. I, I understand, you know, they don't have their age on their forehead, but like, I'm just going to let you know, or I'm going to remind you, remembering something isn't culpability. Um, if I see somebody, you know, if I, if I saw somebody, God forbid, dog, I'm going to try to remember everything about that guy. Okay. So that doesn't mean that I the dog. It just means that I'm trying to help out here. So what would kind of be the age ranges you've seen of these ass, these true assholes just posting these photos of girls like what would be the kind of the oldest to the youngest oh, I, couldn't, uh, I have no idea what's your best guess um early teens i guess well like 13 14 yeah okay god dang man so these people uh i've really got to get to work uh okay is there more I can leave me your number or? Well, yeah, I mean, of course it's all voluntary to be here. I mean, I need some fried pickles myself. Um, but, you know, Dennis, there's obviously, there's, there's obviously like, there's more to it than that, man. And, you know, there's a, I, I kind of want to ask about some links too, man. And you said you worked at the A, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, I kind of did a little research on you. I did I did give him a heads up that you might be a little bit today and that you'll work over. I mean, I hope you'd work overtime, make it up. I, I gave him a heads up. So, I mean, they said it's all good. I just told him like, 
I just told him, like, my name's Gordon, I'm a relative of his, there's kind of an emergency in the family that, you know, Granson will be able to show up to work and that you'll kind of make it up a day that you're off. I mean, I, I already told him that, so, I mean, I wouldn't worry about that if I were you. And I did tell him you'll be back tomorrow. Uh, I am worried. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I told him, like, you'll be back tomorrow. I can't afford to miss work, so. I know, I know. But I already talked and they said they'll give you an extra day and shit. Well, I can't help that. I got, still got to go to work. No, I understand. You can... You can do what you want, but, you know, again, Dennis, like obviously this is a lot more important because you know if some of this stuff doesn't get addressed there there's a possibility there is no work and there's a possibility that you know this all goes to shit because i really 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 i mean i'm taking the time with you to actually you know for basically us to prove that hey this is not something that you were a part of this is not something that you liked but you know if I didn't come here, people could have gotten the wrong idea about that. So I came here to actually dispel that. And you're actually doing a good job of separating yourself from these people. Um, I didn't tell your work about what was going on. I didn't tell them anything like that, nor do I have that intention of. But, you know, I did as many solids as I can for you. And, yeah, I understand it's, you know, work is, in, work is for sure important. But, you know, you'll make it up. And, um, yeah, dude, I, 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 can't, I can't tell you much more than the fact that I, I called in advance. I already consider that possibility. I don't know exactly what shift you worked, but I just told him like, hey, there's some shit in the family. So, I mean, look, I know you got a wife you to prepare to, uh, I know you got a wife to provide for. I know you got kids to provide for and shit. So trust me, dude, I'm not, I'm not letting internet bullshit be the end all be all, dude. That's not how I operate, okay? Um, but I, I, I do want to ask, you know, because Pardon me. you're good, man. I do want to ask, and I, and I know this shit's so hard to talk about, Dennis, and, you know, when it's hard for you to explain this shit, that actually gives me a peace of mind because it shows me that you don't actually like this shit and that you're not a sociopath and all that crap. But, um, you know, we, we did see some videos clicked on, okay, and there's just, we know with these Spanish groups, that's the race we hear the most, okay, especially from hardworking men like you. Um, there's some shit clicked on, and we think there's some stuff posted um, that was kind of younger than that. By me? No, 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 hell no. But posted by these idiots in there, okay? And, you know, the, the typical, you know, I mean, the fact you didn't tell me that is like, I mean, it shows me that it's, it, it's, it's actually a touchy subject for you, because probably because you have grandkids. But... You know, I know these Hispanic guys have no limits with what they post, so I'm just gonna ask you to be straight up. Um, have they posted stuff called mega links in these groups? Uh, couldn't tell you. Okay, well, have they posted just links where more of these videos or pictures pop up on? I'm sure they have. Okay. Can you kind of uh, describe the format of what was on those links on some of them? What do you mean, format? Like, basically, a link is clicked on. What kind of pops up in these groups? Like, not not a link to the group, but in the, in this signal group, they post a link, and then it's clicked on. What, what does that link kind of look like? Uh, it just goes to whatever, the, the picture or whatever. Okay. How many pictures are on these links usually? Is like Some of them have multiple, or...? No, most of them just one. Most of them just, okay. So it's a link to a picture? Yeah. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just ask it one more time, Dennis. Uh, I'm thinking you probably got a little bit carried away with some of this stuff, which you're a guy on the internet with a switch. If you haven't been carried away on the internet, um, so I think you probably looked at some photos of teens, which is whatever. They're not like kids' kids. But what's been posted in there is different than what you looked at. Um, I don't think those are synonymous with each other, okay? But we've all been to Chinese buffets, right? We've all ignored the pizza on the, we've all We've all ignored the pizza in the Chinese, but we all don't like that shit. We all, you know, go for the chicken or whatever. If you go for the pizza, you're probably a menace to society. Um, so I'm, I'm going to ask, like, we know in group they were posting videos of infants and toddlers in there okay we know that that's something we know for sure because we've kind of dug into that group uh, what i'm gonna ask what, dennis yeah what i'm gonna ask okay how's it going ma'am it's going okay hi 
how's it going? We're just having a conversation here. He's just, uh, people have just been doing some crazy stuff online uh, with him. He, he's good himself, but it's just kind of important to get through. But if you want to go to work, I mean, are I you, told him I got to are go you to work. detaining him? Nope. I never said I was. But, you know, ma'am, I did also call his job ahead of time and say it could be a lengthy conversation, and they already said they can, he can make up a day and stuff like that. So I've already taken care of all that. I, know, I of course, know he's providing for you. Um, um, I, I work at home, so I... But okay. thank you. Well, yeah, well, I, I, I know you all rely on, him, rely on him, sure, sure. But, but, um, but it, it's, it's pretty important stuff, ma'am. It, are you with the police department? Nope, absolutely not. It's pretty important stuff that... Um, it might be some stuff that could be used against him. I'm not so sure. Well, it's a great I, I, conversation. Well, I'm here to make sure that stuff doesn't get used against him because people have been adding, adding him to some stuff that has not been the most flattering. But he's actually doing a good job of like kind of pointing out the real bad guys doing this shit. That's what I care about. I don't care about Dennis who works hard and gets on his phone so once in a who while. Are you with if you're not it's called Kid Protectors USA. My name's Gordon. Yep. So, um, yeah, that's kind of a... Uh, but you'll probably work with the police department, I'm sure, trying to... Here? No. Absolutely not. FBI? Nope. I was just wondering, I assume you're trying to help these girls or keep this stuff off the internet? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Absolutely. I care more about the people actually out just there, out there doing this stuff more than the, you know, I mean, everybody kind of looks at stuff online. That's not what I really care about. So that's why I'm here talking to him because obviously, you know, there's many different ways this could go besides the conversation at the house about it. And, you know, I didn't know you overheard any of it. I guess you did. And did. sure. It's okay. I mean, I just, I just know from experience, you know, if you say the wrong thing, it can really get twisted around. Right. And, so. you know, so what would be counted as the wrong thing is just him being in these groups in the first place. And what is getting untwisted is him actually saying like, so, so I didn't know before coming here that he didn't make any of these groups himself. I didn't think he did, but I also didn't know. Um, so it turns out he was just on Facebook and people were just posting stupid links and he just clicked on links and that's what kind of got into this little ruckus here. Okay. So that actually gives me a peace of mind and it gives, you know, it gives, it gives everybody peace of mind. He, you know, he's, he's a granddad and you're a grandma, right? Yeah. And you know, when he's actually identifying what these people are posting in the group and what's going on, that actually helps save kids. Is he going to go to Mexico and go find someone chained up? No, of course he's not. But can he be that first step to actually doing that? Of course he can. He's actually doing a really good thing right now. And, um, yeah, there's been some f***ed up shit posted in the group. I'm not going to lie about that. But as far as we see, he hasn't been doing any of that himself. It's just been, you know, wrong place, wrong time. Right, and but if you say you went on there, even if it was by mistake, it can get... It can get nasty. Well, that's not how I look at things. But yeah, it could get nasty, absolutely. But that's not how I look at things. Careful. Yeah, of course, of course. But, um, you know, if, if you don't mind, we're getting some good info because he was saying, like, you know, these assholes are posting links. And, you know, I'm good with computers. So links is something that I can easily go to and just kind of see, like, you know, where'd this come from? So me personally, no, I don't work with any PD here. But there's organizations like, you know, charities and stuff like that that this can get passed on to they do the they do the international stuff i'm not you know if i if i went and knocked on everybody who looked up online i wouldn't leave this neighborhood you know what i mean so it's just it, it just happened to be like out of all the spanish people that you know we just had like two tennessee numbers and that's all and the other guy from tennessee we talked to it was very cordial conversation um you know he was basically like hey this is kind of what they were posting yeah i shouldn't have been here it's all good and i'm like yeah dude just kind of you know be careful just give him like a little love slap you know and then uh not saying i actually slap him but you know just give him like come on dude and then move on um so that's kind of my plan well, here my uh, my my angle is that i was pre-law mm -hmm. ditched it for a job that i didn't have to pay so much for school for but um i mean and i don't pretend to know a lot of stuff I just yeah yeah you know you just got to be careful I mean would it be better if he had a lawyer while he talked to you to help you figure some stuff out or well no because in that case I mean I take I take someone getting a lawyer as like oh well that's kind of shows me that there's more to it than just them getting added to groups and that's right. kind of where I'm like all right well I don't I also don't have a beer myself and unfortunately in in my case that they took something that they just twisted it all around and it wasn't mm -hmm. true at all and my attorney was like you shouldn't have talked to him i was like 
Well, well we, it was the truth. And he's like, well, you know, they can change it. Right. Well, obviously, I don't have any ability to change anything. Um, but, you know, when it comes to child safety, I'm sure you guys as grandparents take that very seriously. Absolutely. And, you know, if there's, if there's anything he can do, which he's doing a great job of to actually help make kids safer, which he's been doing, that's an opportunity that you can't turn down, especially if, especially when you know like you said it could be it could be twisted it could be absolutely twisted him being in the groups and you know i didn't come here to do that i didn't come here being judgmental like oh why are you here why is this and that he actually clarified a lot of things where i'm like oh whew, okay that's whew, that's a lot better than i thought it would be so yeah that i mean i'm sorry about your case i mean i don't really know about it but i'm, I'm sure that it was bs but i'm sure it also wasn't some digital online bullshit either no it wasn't anything okay. online but so Wait. My, my kids would be surprised because I can't hardly turn one on, but right. they'd be surprised right. if I was doing anything on that. For sure, for sure. They'd be like, you can't even turn a computer on. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, if you want to uh, be here while we talk, that's fine. Or if you want to go back inside, it doesn't matter. I mean, it's your, your, your domain. You're the queen here. Um, so, but yeah, I mean, there, there is important stuff because, you know, I, I do care. I'm sorry. Okay. What time does your shift end today? Uh, 10.45. Okay. 11.15. Okay. Well, if, if you don't mind, can we, can we just have like 15 more minutes just, you know, kind of go over some last things then, you know, obviously you can do whatever you want right now, but, you know, I'll be cool if we just have like 15 more minutes and, you know, I'm willing to kind of go after, because we're, we're getting to some good info on these, on these, uh, on these people. If you don't mind, can we just have like 15 more minutes and then we'll... well say what you got to say so I can go to work. We well, can go to work right now, but, you know, I think for my peace of mind, it would probably be important to, um, you know, kind of go over these last few things. Uh, what was your name? You said... Um, do you want to stay out here for it or do you want to go in or because it, it could get a little bit uh, graphic. You all right? Oh, you can stay. Okay, I'll stay. I think I can handle it. Okay. If, if it's getting too much, you know, obviously don't, don't feel like you need to listen to this stuff because, you know, you know, you can hold your own though, it seems. Yeah. Booger, quit. Okay. So... So Dennis, on that group that I was talking about, the Little Angels for Love, we know they were posting stuff like babies and toddlers in there and that type of stuff. Um, you know, as far as I know, that's not stuff that, you know, you can leave like a little like like emoji on that shit. You know what I mean? Like you can leave like a like, like you know, when you're texting somebody, you can leave like, like their message or something like that. We didn't see you leave any likes on that stuff. So um, I'm not too worried about it, but I'm kind of I'm kind of curious how, how often it was being posted. Like I know in that, have a clue yeah 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 but i know in that group it was semi often whatever but in these other groups like how often did do really bad apples come in there and just start posting that super young stuff i wouldn't have a clue okay um what's your what's your best guess because you know we know we can see when stuff is kind of clicked on i don't know okay Well, you know, Dennis, I mean, we were, we were making such good progress here, but, you know, when stuff like this is getting posted, five to 17 year olds, that wasn't you that posted it, obviously, I don't see you liking, no. liking this, but, you know, we think there's a good possibility they were posting just very young, very young things, like, in, in, in these groups, and again, I mean, you know, you told me you looked at some shit of teens, what, 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 whatever, um, but I'm more curious about the people that have are helpless, you know what I mean? Like the babies that can't do anything. Like, are your grandkids like young? Sadly, I started a bit young. So my oldest is gonna be 16 next month. Okay, well there will be. I do have a, my step-granddaughter is uh, two. 
just turned right. Two. So yeah, I, ha I hate to bring her into this, but this this could this could be her in one of these videos that we're. And no, obviously I'm not. I know she's not in the videos, but this, this could be her. That um, it could be someone just like her in these videos. Yeah. So so that that's why I'm asking. Like, you know, I, I know the ages didn't go down to just 13. I mean, that's just that's not because you like that stuff. It's because of these they don't know what to stop posting. So I'm just asking, like, how often these other groups have they posted just really young shit that just made your skin crawl or shit like that? I didn't have a clue. Okay. Well, is there a reason that it would be maybe clicked on at all? Not that I know of, no. Okay. Because we did see some link clicks that, and on those links, there were stuff that were just super, super young, okay? And, you know, there could have been other shit on there, too. I don't know. But, you know, we know, unfortunately, your eyes have been laid on some shit that's been super young. We haven't seen the videos ourselves. It just gets dinged as like, you know, there's like an AI program. You know what AI is? Uh, artificial intelligence. Yeah, you know, it's kind of like a supercomputer. And it just kind of scans, like, it just gives it its best guess of an age. Like, it would look at me and think, you know, 35, and, you know, I'm 34, like, shit like that. Um, so we've seen videos clicked on. Oh, you're good. We've, see, we've seen videos clicked on that were kind of uh, viewed for a period of time. Uh, you didn't, like, leave a like on any of them or anything, but they were kind of viewed for a period of time. And some of the ages that popped up were, like, looked like one, two, three. Some of them were six and seven and stuff. And this was stuff, this wasn't, this was stuff that was posted by other people, but clicked on by your profile. And the AI told us those ages. So I'm not really, well, I guess the important part about that. I think an, I think an important part about that is the reason those could have been watched because, you know, there are people, Dennis, that give to babies. They they exist. Uh, it's probably, I mean, in the groups, I'm sure they exist. I mean, you've, you've seen these people in the groups. Um, I'm curious why 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 those were clicked on on your end. And honestly, if they can be described and we can kind of figure out the races of some of these kids and maybe what the adult looked like in the videos, that'd be pretty important to kind of figure out, and that can lead us in the actual good direction. Because I'm not, I don't care about getting someone, you know, for having eyes and a brain that's curious. I mean, that's human nature, man. But we know those were clicked on, and I'm just trying to find the reason. Like, was the re I mean, were you curious about this stuff? Did you just kind of click on it? What, like, what happened with that? Uh, if I clicked it, it was a mistake. Okay. Okay. How many times do you think you accidentally clicked on some shit and, like, a super young video popped up? I'm not talking 13. I'm talking about, like, one to five. Uh, probably more than twice. Really? Okay. But that's not something matter what. Of course. Of course. But just the fact knowing that these people are posting that babies in this group, I mean, that, that tells me that I gotta go after some of these groups. And guess what, when I do that, I'm leaving your name out of that shit because that's important. Because <laughs> if you can be a bowling ball that takes down 10 bowling pins, why would I wanna destroy the bowling ball? It makes no sense to me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So. I'm just, I'm just, I don't understand who, who you're with. Kid Protectors USA. Yeah, but like, is that a non-profit or? Is it a non-profit? Um, no, it's more of like, it's, it, we're, we're an organization. We're an organization. Um, we're just kind of, you know what an NGO is? I don't. It's a non-governmental organization. So, you know, we just kind of help out with that. And, you know, we actually have resources too. We have resources for and We have resources for just kind of and stuff like that. And I'm leaning towards that's more of his situation than fucking, you know, I mean, this was a bodies in the basement situation. I wouldn't be the one showing up. You know what I mean? That's, and right. I'm sure you wouldn't be out here kind of vouching for him either, but you know. Not if there was a body in the, it might be me, so I may not be out here. I'd be in the basement. Right, right. The body in the basement. You don't even have basements out here, do you? <laughs> not really. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cross face. Yeah. Did you, you should, did you just like ever work around kids or anything? Um, I mean, I had three children, but yeah. um, I worked in mental health. Okay. For several years, I'm aligned with right now so that's why you're so kind of comfortable hearing this stuff i guess yeah, okay unfortunately okay. yeah yeah well too much crime tv too probably so. oh well that, that never helps anything um okay and you know this is this is good info like if he like i'm not gonna lie to you if he told me that yeah i have a video myself of him of me and a little baby yeah i'd be like all right just uh, i mean i'd probably you know what i mean and i'm not saying i would do that but 
you, who knows if I heard something like that, right? But, you know, if shit was clicked on and we get good info, like, about kind of what this asshole's posting, god damn, man. I mean, you know. So like, y'all are recording, right? Yeah, we're on prop. We're on your property, of course, of course. Like that. That's that's a non-negotiable because, dude. I'm six foot. I know he's big, but I'm six foot four. And, dude, all all it takes is. And you know, I know you can hold your own. I know you, I know you're 18, but you know, all it takes is one little old lady to say he threatened me and this and that. I'm like, oh, absolutely. The I did not. So, that's kind of why I'm. That, that, that's for my ass. You could see where I'm standing. If he helps you, mm -hmm. and and thereby is admitting to anything, then. It's on tape and video and well, that can't be a good situation. Sure, but what I'm talking about, I'm talking about child and child rape. Him saying that he clicked on a link that was some asshole kid, that doesn't mean he's child That right. means that he's helping me find that person who did. Yeah, it was a little bit of a and went into some groups he shouldn't have been into. I'm not going to sugarcoat that. I'm not going to say, oh, no, it's all good. I don't know. Um, but, you know... <laughs> There's a difference between being a little dorky and then actually doing some bad shit. And if I thought he was doing bad shit, I wouldn't have called his job ahead of time and said, hey, he might be a little bit today. Um, I mean, I don't know. Police are allowed to lie. They are? So, you know, could you be a police person? I'm not a you, cop. You know what I'm saying, though? That's what I'm just like, you're not. I may be a pig, but I'm not a cop. What the f*** is that? Did you want to be all called? Negative. Negative, I did not. Maybe it's a neighbor or something. No, okay. that's how you call. Well, how would I have called? You just had your phone there. Nope, I can show you my phone history right now. Literally, look. It's look, totally literally did not call any cops. No, I didn't. You sure? Maybe it was oh, your grandkid? I don't think so. All right, well, it's gonna... Sir, how's it going? I'm all right, how are you? Good. Somebody in there called the police? I would not assume they, so. I didn't. Are they uh, afraid of me? They think I look menacing since I came over and joined the conversation. Well, you, you can't mess with a country lady from Tennessee. Maybe so. Oh, I'm actually from Alabama. That's even even worse. Even worse. <laughs> yes. How's it, how's it going, sir? Great. <laughs> Hi, Eric. We're just we're just. <laughs> we're just kind of having a conversation here about. Um, you know, he, he, he clicked on a few groups that had some child porn in them. And basically these, these asshole idiots and these, oh, he was, I mean, he was giving me great info on what these people were posting. I mean, they were posting just these nudes of like 13 year old and now that nasty shit in there. Right. Well, they were young. I don't know. 13. Yeah. But I mean, you know, he, I mean, he told me that they, they were in these groups. I mean, he clicked on two videos that were like of a one to five year old, just fucking, it was some crazy, it was some crazy shit. I mean. I mean, they, they were posting really fucked up shit in some of these groups, weren't they? I mean, god damn, man. It's pretty bad, huh? Okay, well. So, what brought you here? We got a call that somebody was viewing child. Are you curious about this stuff? Yeah, you can hang on. Can I chat with you okay. for a second? Sure. Yeah. Okay. I'll get with you in a second. Do you you don't mind. Okay. It's like a super young video popped up. I'm not talking 13 to 5 Valley. 1 to 5. Uh, that's not relevant to me right now. Okay. So you do work with the cops around here? I don't work with the cops. I just asked. I just asked if you work with the cops. God damn it, dude. He would have confessed to everything. Yeah. I wasn't being disrespectful. I've got to take control. Yeah, no, no, 100%. 100%, 100%. And I have to, I have to 
for his for my sake and the investigation's sake, yeah. I gotta be on his side. Yeah, oh, 100%, 100%. Okay. So what's going on? Okay, so we have... Do you have ID on you? So uh, you have yeah, it's in the core, Mega. Right, I'll get it. I'll okay. Get it. So, did you get his phone, by the way? Not yet. Okay. I still want him to go deleting shit. Well, let's tell me what you're doing here. Well, what's going on? so we, we have a group where we catch online child and we typically post monitors online message a kid, blah, 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 to meet up. But what we've been doing recently is we've been, we've been kind of finding groups online where we think people are posting child. We have all the settings off in the group so we don't see any of the images. So for example, we found this guy listed in a group. It just kind of looks like, well, not Justin Trudeau, but it kind of looks like, it kind of looks like this. So we just see this phone number and we run his phone number. We see it comes out to him. And I confirm that is his phone. I guess you got his phone number too, but I confirm that's his phone number too um, when I first talked to him. And so we go in the groups, all the images look like this. So obviously we can't like see what it is. We can just think. And um, so he was in like 15 groups that we saw that were all like called little kids, little angels, CP this, CP that. And he admitted to viewing pictures that he said were like 13 to 14, uh, like full frontal in the group. And Obviously, from what more honest people have told us, it never stops at that. And, you know, uh, his, his wife, like, we were talking for like an hour and a half, and that's what he admitted to. Um, and he said that he's found the links on Facebook, and his wife came out and started kind of like helping him shut down. But before that, I was like, dude, I know there was stuff clicked on of super young stuff, like stuff like between one through five. Um, I'm just trying to find the reason it was clicked on, dude. And he's like, okay, well, I've clicked on that stuff. His words verbatim more than twice of a video of a one to five year old. Let me okay. Can you get your, uh, your yeah, and and we have clips for you to play too of him saying this stuff. On his phone for like. I know, I know, dude. He's fucking deleting everything off there. Oh my god. Said so like one to five year olds. Of course, we didn't actually see that. You know, in this we're in the group. He's like, well, that's happened more than twice. His own words. He's clicked on very young students. Now, what, what age range is happening? We, have, that, we have a clip from all two to be watching. Yeah, I think. Did you watch that already? I think it's, or did you just tell me? No. You don't have Both? I don't think I've played the whole thing for you. Yeah. Okay, so have there been times where somebody's posted something on it? I've been able to only avoid it with their own. Here it is. Good enough. Good enough. I'm not playing the vigilante bullshit. Turn the cameras off. But I would like to talk to you. Yeah, if, you if you guys will record from the street, it's different on their property. Okay.
feminists are actually atrocious, though. I couldn't agree anymore. Better than CCs. If you want to support the Predator Poachers catching the sickest both near and far, go to the pinned comment. If you're on Rumble, press the red join button to see over 30 videos early and uncensored for only $8 a month. We can't do this without your help, so join our locals. 